<laughs> Apologies, everybody. Hi. I did not have the microphone set up. Yep, all right, I think that's gonna be good. Well, hi, everybody. Um, I am going to be doing the uh, first slot in the exhibition series here. And I'm um, going to have some fun. I'm going to find out if for this Ferrari 458 is any good around Suzuka, which I would expect it to be. Um, this will be the last sort of fun event before I need to really buckle down and get serious for the Nations Regionals, which is going to be on uh, November 8th, Sunday, a week and a half from now. And uh, we competitors have yet to receive a driver briefing email. Historically, we get it about a week, week and a half in advance. So we're right in that window now of getting it. And I'm sure um, all of the competitors worldwide, there's about, I think, 100 of us or so, maybe a little bit more than that combined, are waiting with bated breath and uh, very chewed nails. <laughs> and uh, I'm a good example of that because uh, we all are nervous. We all want to do well. But until then, we can just have a little fun today. See if the Ferrari is any good at Suzuka. So, I have not set a time trial time, but I have done a practice race, and uh, we got to use all three compounds of tire for this one. That means uh, two pit stops at minimum. Tire wear is not too heavy, and in the test race, the Ferrari was pretty uh, easy on its tires, actually, and wore them equally front to back. So I think I'm going to try and have my longest stint of this 18-lap race on the soft tires. I think they can last maybe 10 or 11 laps. Um, the medium tires about three quarters of a second slower per lap, maybe about a second. Um, we don't have to worry about fuel. Fuel is uh, not going to be, you know, we don't have to refuel or save or anything. It's just basically a flat out sprint. Um, I have, uh, I lack some ultimate pace. I was in a server with uh, Cooper and Windfire maybe an hour ago. They were doing uh, qualifying simulations, and I was unable to match their time. I got within about four tenths of it. All right. Bringing up chat, make sure I can see anyone who's uh, is watching. If you said anything, you may have to repeat it. Apologies. But uh, I got chat up on my phone, so I'll be watching. So I, uh, I did not see any other Ferraris on the timing board here. Got a bunch of uh, Corvettes, V8s, Vantages, Mustang, Genesis of course is good. Viper is amazing here. Card span getting up there with the Peugeot, the front wheel drive RCZ is really impressive. The car's uh, a monster on the straightaways and if he's able to uh, manage his tires decently it's not too heavy of a tire wear race and block effectively through uh, Sector 1 and 2, uh, then he will not be challenged in Sector 3, since uh, that's all just power and acceleration out of the hairpin and out of Spoon heading up to 130R and Casio, and of course the front straight. Uh, the Ferrari I've got is kind of like a good at everything, not great at anything sort of car. And I think its greatest advantage is the even tire wear. This low tire wear is going to be, I think, a, a great advantage to me. So I don't know if I'm going to be fast just out of the box. I have to wait for the race to kind of come to me. But uh, if, you, if you could see my hands, I'm gesticulating all sorts of uh, things to uh, just further emphasize my thoughts. So why don't I uh, go out and do some um, time trial throw. laps. <laughs> Thanks, Nubian. I really appreciate it, dude. Um, I got the text-to-speech set up, so uh, that'll help me. Yeah, dude, it was fun chasing you in that uh, that practice race a minute ago. Yeah, but I suck, so no competition, so I'll win. <laughs> I don't think you suck. 
coming to grips with this, jumping between this and iRacing, and also, you know, just spending time away from the game. It's been all year playing this. BFF cars will be the challenge. BWLB. Yeah, I agree with you. Um, I saw Cards fan at the, the top of the time trial in the Peugeot, and uh, he's going to be successful in, you know, blocking them, anyone from passing them in Sector 1 and 2, then after this hairpin up here, he's just going to take off and It'll be hard to, to get around that guy. On new tires, he's definitely going to be the fastest car on track. Yeah. So I feel a little rusty. We should be doing um, 205, 9, 206 flat and quality, and I'm doing like 206, 3. So there's still time for me to find. Definitely imperfect and breaking. I think I'm leaving time on the table and the screen here. Being a little too cautious on the entry. I just don't want to run wide, you know, because that like fucks up the, the whole lap by a good five seconds or more. Turn one as well. I saw an Aston Martin do one one laps on softs and have decent 206, 207. I'll have a look at what you said real quick. Before I get to this. I'm not as uh, good as at looking at chat while racing like Cyrus or someone. The guy looks at it I don't know, 10 times a lap. So I'm asking to do 11 no laps on the top. Okay. Yeah, I, I think I gotta do as long of a stint as I can on the softs. Uh, I see some people are gonna do two stints on softs and then one lap on medium and hards. And uh, the pit stop is like. It's like 10 seconds cost, and I don't know if that's going to be worth it if my tire wear is pretty low. So I think I'm going to stick with two stops. Eight, eight, one, one. starting, I don't know, I'm, I'm really debating starting on parts and just getting it out of the way, because at the start of the race, I can uh, frustrate and delay the cars behind me for one lap while I do parts, and sort of guarantee, if, if they're not going to shove their way around me during that one lap, that I'll have a, a bit of an advantage when the cycling completes. Um, that way, you know, you get out of uh, traffic right away doing that first stop, hopefully, uh, have some free air to just put in the fast laps. I'm not paying attention to it right now. One and a half seconds off what I should be doing. Just so you know, the sound of the car is a little too loud. I can hear you speak, but it could be balanced better. Alright, dude, thank you very much. That's, uh, I really appreciate that. Uh, let's see what I can do here. All right, let's go to here. Hmm, sound the screen. Or is it gonna be under sharing? I think it might be under sharing. Broadcast settings, perhaps. No. Hmm. I think there's a way for me to balance the, uh, the audio. Yeah, I'm just doing straight with the PS4. I don't have a capture card yet. It's on the wish list. <laughs> uh, I've got I've got you know OBS and a Streamlabs account and stuff um, for when I'm doing anything on the PC. But uh, for the PlayStation, I don't have that uh, hardware just yet.
Thanks, dude. Uh, your input is appreciated. Thank you very much. All right. Let's make sure it's not something I can change here. No. Uh, advanced. Nope. Just one more check here. Yeah, well, I turned up the mic level a couple of clicks. Oh, like maybe, uh, I see what you mean. All right, dude, take it easy. I'll see you around. Later, bro. to replay just yet. All right. Looks like folks you might have uh, might have joined watching. Welcome. My uh, race OBM stream in about 25 minutes. Just doing some uh, time trial warm up right now. I can get like to a 205 two. 255 five. I'll be alright with that so I just haven't practiced like at all I'm just not playing this game while waiting for the regional driver briefing to come out but maybe uh, setting the game on the shelf has been a mistake because rust does take a while to knock off second off of the fastest guys. Well 
What's up, Eddie? Hi. Hey, Hell Ruler. that Casio triangle. Probably left like a quarter of a second on the table there. What's your money? Uh, it's Ferrari, my friend. Decided to uh, go with the uh, antithesis to Porsche for this exit season, just for fun. And I noticed nobody was using Ferrari, so why not? the bad boys. Yeah, it's okay with like doing everything. It doesn't really excel anywhere. And it's got really good tire I'm wear. I can't do the Tristan. Do what, Eddie? the destruction sequence. Ah. It's a HAL 9000 Sorry, impression. Try to sound like HAL. Yep. I got you, buddy. It's, I'm afraid I can't do that. Cool voice. I'll do one more lap here, and then I'll uh, exit and sign up. And then maybe then I'll, uh, I'll load like a ghost or watch a hot lap of one of the faster guys. See if I'm missing anything fundamental, which I usually am. I try not to rely on those replays if I can help it. It's always kind of good to fi figure it out on your own, but those replays do help a lot. At first I was afraid, I was petrified, kept thinking I could never live without you by my side. <laughs> I'm glad you guys are enjoying the text-to-speech. Just a little bit. Hmm. There we go. That's the best I've done spoon right there. Really gentle on the brakes. And scrub speed in the second half of it while hugging the curb. That's the way to do it. Alright, let's see if I can do Casio proper. Get under a 205.5 like I hope. Be like Leclerc, not Vettel, you got it. 
better, but not not very good. Alright. Hit the target. It's good. Alright. 254. I don't think that's a top 10 time. Yeah, it's not. Alright, so I'm inside a second of the fastest guys, at least. Uh, so let's hope that my tire wear helps me out. Maybe not the best Ferrari track, but hey, it's alright. Let's uh, just do what we can with what we have. Matters so little. Ugh. I am not someone... I mean, like, I take pride in a high driver ranking number, but... Uh, you know, I care little if um, I finish 10th or 15th. Yeah, top 10 against this field is always a, a great accomplishment. All right, so let's practice. Have a sip of the old Perrier, because I'm snooty like that. I appreciate you guys joining. It's only a couple people, but you know, it means a lot. It means a lot to me. It's fun mixing it up at this point. Everyone knows each other. Indeed. All right, let's see. Any mid-engine cars in the top 10? No. <laughs> front-wheel drive, front-wheel drive, front-wheel drive. A Viper, huge engine, front-wheel drive. Corvette, I think a watch staggers lap. Oh, I can't. Dirt. All right, well, whatever. like that. The exit out of Spoon and I, or um, Casio there. Super important. A little too fast in there. Let's call that a rambunctious entry speed. Catching the dirt there, it's not a good thing. It is kind of difficult figuring out what the car wants to do, what it's kind of capable of. It does turn best on partial throttle. Let's say like uh, around like half throttle. It's when it rotates the most willingly. It's really stable, you know, the brakes are pretty okay. Do have to use first gear up here. I don't know if these guys are using like the if that e-brake trick now applies to every car. I hope not. I don't want to have to learn a gimmick. Be back for the race. Gotta do some stuff. All right, I'll see you, homie. This will be fun. I have no Not pressure. Right there. Gotcha. Do you know if it was um, any more successful for for Cy, the, the e brake, or was it more like a hassle?
but he always loves the break L U L. Yeah, he does. I think I heard him say on his stream that he's bent his eight brake handle on his sim rig from just you know, excessive use. I thought that was really funny. Tells me the guy is confident in kicking it sideways. I think I'm slow out of that corner, but that's kind of how I got to do it. Even in first gear, I can't kick the, the tail out in this car. The Viper's got a huge advantage coming out of the hairpin because it can. It's got the torque to do it in second gear. thousands of my best. It's pretty alright. I think consistency is going to be important here. So I don't run wide, turn one. If I'm, if I'm consistent, I think I'll probably pick up a couple of positions from attrition. This is not, uh, not the easiest track. It's certainly not forgiving when all the runoff is grass. There's no like pavement like a modern F1 track. I'm taking that too wide. That's uh, the end of the S is there, that long left. I'm driving it like Ford it's a cannon. Really fast here. Yeah, Holman. Holman's getting faster, dude. Every time I see him, he's a little bit faster. He's, uh, I, I think I, I first raced against him in the Pinnacle season, which was over December, January, uh, and then he took place in the online championships, you know, this year, and he improved a lot between the first time and the second time I encountered him. That's really impressive. I wonder what's changed for him. If it's uh, been hardware changes or if he's just um, studied, practiced. time that time. Not the fastest exit, but uh, just kind of hustled it more on the front tires. Let's see. Yeah. 9,000 is off the best sector. Dive it in, scrub the front tire with a brief lift at the apex. That's that seemed like the faster way to do that. Break a little later, a decker or two, just a little bit. Hmm. Bought the farm on that one. Maybe I can break a little bit later for that too, but I like my breaking points. I think my breaking points 
are uh, were established from tire wear being on. And if I learn like brand new breaking points with no tire wear on and go into the race, then maybe I'm going to be all flummoxed and screw up. So I'm not going to worry about it. The point is not fastest time trial time anyway. It's Breaking points are solid in my opinion as well. Thanks, dude. Missing those apexes in the middle of the S's. They're tucking in a little tighter. Yeah, I'll be, I think we'll be mid pack. That'll be fun. Hopefully, have some good dicing with people. I'll do my best not to ruin anyone's race. Always the goal. I was smart and made sure I had uh, space to save the replay. Bar. flat and I didn't quite make it. I also kind of cut the corner so maybe if I had better turn in timing I might be able to do it flat. Is at three three seven or something right now. Okay. I hope he and I are going to be in the same split. I know he's been, uh, but he also has like multiple accounts. So maybe I'll see SV Cyrus. In which case, uh, that'd be great to have a, a fat uh, fight with him. That was a lot better. Size in the Corvette, isn't he? There 
go. Sector 3, Sector 4. A little bit of improvement. Optimum 20537. Matchmaking. All right. I hope nobody's expecting anything from the guy with car number one. Because <laughs> they shouldn't. Good luck. Thank you very much. I'll do my best, Eddie. My goal is going to be finish ahead of Cyrus. Good luck, man. <laughs> Duel of the Saber. Thanks, Hell Ruler. Oh. Yeah, it's going to be on. <laughs> Sweet. <laughs> on like Donkey Kong. You better bring his receipts, because this return's getting voided. I don't even know what that means. <laughs> Today on Road Beef, euphemisms that make no sense. Ha <laughs> ha. Sorry for bonking the microphone there. Look at all these aliens here, OMG. Yep. Senate, Windfire, Cooper, Lester, Cyrus, Girthquake, Dino, Holman, Cards Fan, Lit, Chris, Prana, James Bond, Su Shoots. It's crazy fast. Excuse me, Swordsman? It's awesome to see Swordsman here. <laughs> Cyrus says. Oh, that's funny. Oops. All right. Do some warm up here. I think I am gonna do my uh, Hello. my hard, medium, soft strategy. What's up, Lorenzo? Thanks for stopping by, my friend. Lorenzo Iorovic 98 was a MOG face with stuck out tongue and closed eyes. <laughs> That's so funny. I'm I using the PlayStation's text to speech and it's like category in your colon underscore closed eyes. Hell are you Makes no sense. Alright, time to qualify. Should have time enough for two time laps. Oh, wow. Like no one in front of me, no one behind me. I'm not going to bother trying to catch a draft. If I do, I do. If I don't, I don't. Group fours are really only very slightly affected by dirty air. It still makes an incremental difference. I kind of like not following some if I can help it. Just get that little extra bit extracted from the last time. Yeah, I like 
make extra space as well. Hi, Cyrus. Right here, completing my lap, that would be perfect. Have them tug me down this back straight. Not my best Casio triangle, but whatever. go. Alright, we got the brake bias set up. Yep. Here we go. I'm not nervous. Shut up. Wrist breaking later for Degner 2 there. Worked out, I think. If Cyrus sticks around and does a second lap, I think I will too. enough. Catch his draft. Looks like Windfire put in a pretty good lap too. Two six zero. Wow, I'm surprised. That's uh, that's a third of a second faster than I was able to do um, in practice so far. And I've practiced about two hours now. Excellent. All right, let's go out and do another one. Wow, Holman. Lester behind me. Got. These guys in front of me. I want to try to get ahead of Dino if I can help it, but you know, there's time. Might be able to do one more after this. We'll see how it goes. He has enemy titties on his hood. It almost looks like it is. That's also a Freudian slip on my behalf. If I see a flesh colored anything that's a W shape, it's like, oh, yep, definitely titties.
Dino's maybe considering letting me go. It's hard to say what's going on here. Inside the mind of a carjacker. You let me go, buddy? Are you just like lifting off? Alright, here we go. hits. So I think I'll continue to lap do two hot laps. Here we go. subpar. Just try to hustle it through the rest. Spoon was okay. Spoon was pretty okay. Looks like it was wise for me to get around Dino. I'm gonna be down though in the sector. Surprisingly not. Okay. Through 16,000s, but it wasn't enough. Let's see if I can clean it up a little bit. I've done the Dignors. Oh, I'm down three tenths. It's not going to happen. See out the lap anyway. feeling Cooper is going to put in a faster lap, but it'd be nice if I went ahead of Cooper. Uh, 
And my last sector is better. Went from like 0.385 down to 0.290 from sector 2 to sector 4. So I think I had I had something there. I, I might have been able to challenge Holman, but uh, couldn't put it together. So kudos to him. go. Alright, well, should I still do my hard, medium, soft strategy? <sighs> I think it too has a great lap nevertheless. Well, thank P3. you very much. Thanks, Hell Ruler. I have to be satisfied with P3 for sure. For sure. You know, quarter second off a of wind fire, not bad. Uh, I get adrenaline shakes times like this. So fast. Thanks, Kim. I will do my best. You know what? I got nothing to lose. Why not? I'll just I'll run my uh, my redonkulous strategy. One lap hards. Uh, I think like six laps mediums, maybe even five laps, and then just sauce all the way to the end. Dante start hearts. Welcome to the Twitch, Berardi. Hey, what's up, guys? Don't start hearts, Sim Racers Lime says. Well, all right, fine. We're starting mediums. Because I want to save sauce to the end. Hearts. I want softs on a light car with low fuel so I can just attack 10 tenths. Ugh. Berardi. I wonder if that's Brian Berardi. Brian Berardi, fellow friend of Philip Schupach. In which case, greetings and welcome. Hey, that's Armin, by the way. MOG Hard. <laughs> Hi, Armin. Sim Racers Lounge. Armin goes for the Lounge Monopoly. <laughs> the make things. Gosh, that makes me hungry. <laughs> the Armin? Agakon! <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I couldn't help myself. Uh, all right, Armin hey, seven viewers. That's great. Laughing the only Armin. Oh, <laughs> oh, good. oh, Cooper. Oh, no, that's Holman. Holman's in the Volkswagen. Duh. I thought Cooper switched to the wall. Too different. Not dumb. Yes. Forget I said anything. MOG waving hand. Ha. That Rossi guy had it coming. MOG victory hand with light skin tone. MOG victory hand with light skin tone. Huh. Victory hand with light skin tone. Hi, Kim Sognitis. Cyrus and his sweet livery. I think Earthquakes actually looks pretty cool too. Little Prana. And there's Lester. Oh, cool. That's a Mario Kart um, Super Nintendo theme. Alright. Penalty system is highly illogical. Yes, it is totally illogical. Shoots. You look hard. Robert. I wonder what happened. Back in 16th. He's got some work to do. I bet he'll he'll break top ten for certain. Uh, you know, 
The Alexa cars look pretty sharp. Swordsman! Fastest lumberjack in the USA. Hello, Uh, yeah, Brian, or McTaint, uh, Kim Sognet, this is, uh, Kim, wife Kim, whom you met, uh, at Phil's wedding. And, uh, Austin, of course. Duh! Duh! I'm such a, a dumbass. Okay. A little bit of run going here. Alright. Cold tires. All right, I'll try to look at chat on the straightaways, but I'm going to try and focus right now. Oh. Hi, Brian. I was not going to guess it was you from your name. No. No chat to you. Got an impatient Cooper on my tail. Roll the name throws everyone off. Whoa! Did not expect that. I didn't look at my radar as I was turning in. Maybe I should have expected him there. Sorry, dude. Didn't mean to do that. All right, I'm gonna do. My achievement was eating BBQ until I literally sick when we went to the Austin GP. <laughs> Eating enough barbecue until you're sick is an achievement. I know something happened to Cooper. Shoot. Maybe he put a wheel off? Maybe I didn't leave enough room? I'll have to review. We'll look at lap two in the replay and see if I left him enough room or maybe I shoved him off. I hope it's not the latter, but I'll own up to it if that's the case.
can T go wrong double in Texas BBQ and racing. <laughs> Indeed. Now this is pit racing. Happy you think so. <laughs> Cooper's already on my tail. Cooper will bite his time and probably try it out his spoon instead of into spoon this time. Watch the radar just at that moment, so I just sort of approximated where he's going to be and really didn't want to pinch him or make contact, so you know, whatever. I delayed him, so mission successful. I just hope that I wasn't the reason he went off earlier. Superstar took Cyrus out in the last corner. Oh no. Oh Prana. He and Cyrus are like magnets, they always seem to find each other. It's too bad. At least Cyrus is still eighth. and there's only two corners. I can drive. All right. I think uh, two more laps and then I'm coming in for softs. Or hards, rather. Excuse me. To this lap. It's a good turn one.
Where does about equal between me and Chris, or uh, Cooper and Chris? this left. Hard tires. One lap, and then softs to the end, baby. I think I can make them last 12. They last 10 laps just fine in the practice race. So I think I can stretch him, try to be ginger. Oh good, no traffic. Looks like after my pit I'll come out between another group two, which will be just perfect. But I do think I'm gonna have to execute some passes on track. Here we go. I think I'm the earliest adopter. I'm not certain. be ginger on the tires, so I gotta make them last. Okay, it's in it. I think I need to move that back to four. Get a little push entering the second half of spoon. It's 
see if I can get past James Bond. I think I can. He's flashing me hazards. Thank you, buddy. Thank you very much. I did not to get in the mix there. I think that would have been unwise. Oh, hey. He's going to let me go by. Thank you, buddy. Chase is on. Scrub my speed a little sooner for the second half of spoon there. I think my exit speed was not good.
Oh, hey, all right. sure I review that replay. There have been times before where Cooper was at fault for something he did to me and he went out of his way to apologize. You know, and that's the kind of sportsmanship I, I certainly want to encourage. Indeed it was sweet of him. Alright, so we got Prana, everyone's favorite racer in front of us. Oh, cards fan. <laughs> He's lucky to have made it into the pits. I hope he didn't get a penalty for that. Someone just blipped out. I didn't see who that was, but I saw a car disappear on track. draft. Dinner time, alert mode engaged. Take him. Let's see. All right. That was interesting. far away from Prana enough that he wasn't going to dive on me here. Cool. Well, these guys still got to do their final stop, I think. Except maybe Windfire. I think Windfire might have done his stop and is just uh, having a good stint on mediums. That apex a little bit. Laid on the brakes. We're looking good though. Tire wear is good. No tires, you know, overly stressed. And, 
the six laps, I think I can make it. Amazing how much curve usage is allowed there. Alright, if I finish here, I'll be happy. Very happy. Catching Coleman a little bit, but I'm not catching one fire. Status report. Systems nominal. This is when fires race to lose, but it's, uh, I think Holman will put up a fight. behind me with Prana, I think, is the car with the best tire wear. I think Armin could probably tell me for sure because that's the car, car he campaigned in the online series this year. slowing a little bit.
kind of forgetting about the leaders now and just watching the gap to Cooper. It is true he's on mediums, but, uh, you know, those things don't wear at all. So he could be a threat in the closing laps. We'll see, though. Good workout. And feedback has turned up. I'm gonna watch my uh, my exits. Casio, now the tires are worn enough that it's going to kick into oversteer. Impressive. You were in one first when I tuned in. What was that? Oh, cool. Hi, Mommy. Hi, Mommy. Hi, Bubbly. I think uh, plus four to the back is a good brake balance for this car. You can actually turn it into the hairpin. Pump the gas there. Tristan had an early pit strategy, so it is working out now that the others have pitted too. Yep. Hmm, Holman's gonna do two laps on hearts. Oh, he's on medium? Oh, I see. He did three stops. He's on the three-stop strat, so he's got to stop again to put on hearts. Second place, baby. Balance is good, just overall grip levels are much reduced. Ten viewers. Everybody watching, thank you for joining. It means the world to me. Giggity.
All right, well, I'm going to overtake Holman. I don't think I'm going to catch Windfire, though. Windfire is usually pretty unflappable. Oh, shit, no way. Wow. I did not expect this development. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. I can't believe I just took the lead. Yeah. He's gonna be trying. He's still with it. What just happened? He's got that uh, Hyundai power. Oh man, he's not close enough. Whew. Keep it together, buddy. They have to use the different compounds of tires. Windfire saved his heart stint for last and Tristan already did. Alright, buddy! Yeah! GGs. Yeah, baby! Yeah. Fuck yeah, that's right. Oh man, hell yeah. Yeah, <laughs> Hell yeah. <laughs> <sighs> Shit yes. Oh man. Ferrari on. Good job, <laughs> well done, <laughs> ultimate strat. Thank you. Yay. Thank you, Magic's here. The nap 41, thank you guys. He's the SDRA team man. <laughs> I am the strap man. Skip you, but I would love to do it. I would love to do it. I would love to do it. Some of the beta belonged to the lullaby. Accidental strategy success. Thanks, wife. <laughs> wow. Man, sweeping around Windfire at the beginning of the last kiss, lap, kiss. that was fucking amazing. What a feeling. Whew. Hell yeah. Alright, I did two races with Ferrari and I got a third and a first. Oh yes. Look at that livery. Yeah, especially considering wind is constantly on. Yeah, he is. Yeah, when fire is always up to speed. That guy like me, it's no warm up. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. Oh, I was lagging. Oh, that's too bad. All right, so I'll watch uh, Windfire's YouTube stream, see how much I was lagging. If, I'm, if that happens while well, broadcasting, that's strategy. a problem. 
maybe what I can do is uh, find a way to broadcast over LTE or something. I'll do that when I get a uh, capture card because then I can put it on the PC and then the PC can connect its Wi-Fi to my phone and then that can be the broadcast and then I can devote my Wi-Fi exclusively to game latency. Uh, Cooper says it's all good. The whip is connected to the wind balloon. <laughs> Indeed it is. I was going to write wom, 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 wom. <laughs> oh, man, that was awesome. Oh, that was epic. Cyrus Big Brain Crew Reppin. <laughs> wom, 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 <laughs> Yep. All right, so uh, let's watch that replay. I want to see, you know, just how close I got to Cooper. No. No, the replay won't be. Just as everything appeared on track just now is how the replay will look for me. <laughs> but I'll, I'll find Windfire's um, stream, like I said, and just evaluate. There are workarounds. I'll just need to get a capture card. I don't know what that means. Um, and it's okay. I don't need to know. Okay. <laughs> I mean, long, long story short, just mean, making the, uh, the PC responsible for broadcasting. Okay. Whew. Man, that was hot stuff. That was hot diggity. I think we had a solid, like, uh, 8 to 10 viewers the whole time. Amazing. Two hour stream. Where's me? Uh, from the Cyrus. Yeah. Thank you, Hell Ruler. Thank you very much. Maybe, maybe me lagging is why everyone pulled over and let me go. I, I think that's probably the explanation. Great job, dude. Thanks, Cam. Oh, some racist lounge, Armin. Sorry. Your name and Kim's name are both purple in text, and uh, the text is tiny on my phone. So, Armin, uh, take it as a compliment that I confused you with my wife. We can both be your wife. Yay! <laughs> GT7 better not force us to watch this shit in replays again. Yeah, I agree, Eddie. Skipping the... this is... And it's like, why even... Why show it if the, the qualifying times are not even saved to disc? You know, it's like, oh, they're 19th, but... I don't know what the qualifying time was. It's like defeats the purpose, and it's just a totally redundant um, role. All right. So uh, right at the start, right at the start, I had a little run on Holman. I think just better gearing from low down. Uh, but I believe that he was on softs. In fact, let's uh, take a look. So I'm on mediums, Holman soft, Windfire soft, Cooper soft. Emoji happy tears, Emoji yeah. happy tears. Only cards fan, uh, 
also on mediums. First, we have Chris, Cyrus, it's the right strat. Master on hard. Okay. Let's, uh, let's see this from Cooper's point of view. It's lap one or two where uh, we have the possible coming together. And he also uh, dove me here. Wasn't expecting that. Oh boy, oh boy. It's okay. No harm, no foul. Up front, wind, fire, and Holman going at it. Their little tussle, I think, is really what uh, allowed me to catch up to Windfire at the end there. It was only a matter of, like, you know, less than a second. Typical if I arrived on the scene there, half a second later, I wouldn't have been able to pass Windfire. Sharing is caring. MOG win. MOG happy tears. It really is. sense that he was thinking of something, that's why I defended the inside there. Call that doing a physicality. I think if he had stuck with my draft, he might have uh, challenged me, but he chose to pull out of it. Windfire is that I think he's geographically geographically the furthest away from me in North America. Yeah. Cooper just got a little punt from Luke is away. MOG happy fears, MOG hard, Miss Ludes. really closely. If I was lagging and jumping around, he wouldn't be following, have been following this closely to open two laps. Nice new tool. Whoa. Okay, so there was no contact, but uh, that was definitely close. Good luck in the online final man. Gonna be rooting. Thank you very much, Eddie. Oh, it's Armin. Yeah, we, um, Hopefully the Yabos will pull through, man. All right, let's, uh... Yeah, now he catches me for the real in a real ones, hurry. All the real ones. Let's get forward a little bit. Yeah, so here, he's already on my tail again. to defend, I decided to kind of just give him the inside. Glad I left him room. And then I just put two wheels off. He left me room. That's, uh, that was entirely my fuck up. At least my tires didn't really get dirty. Just 
sort of stuff with it from there. Alright, so uh, he walks away from me, and I slowly walk away from Cart's van. So why don't we skip ahead? Some more action. I'll take my pictures later. I would definitely be interested in feedback on the livery. The logo of which was designed by my wife. And then I threw all the colors and stuff together. But the theme and the motif. Not the livery. It's all wife. I didn't think perfection was impossible, was impossible until I saw the rookie for it. And I just knew. It's a good looking car. I was not expecting the LOL nice win. You streaming for a while? Uh, at least until the end of the replay, Cyrus. Uh, and I'm a little less than halfway through the, the replay, my friend. Um, so probably for another 20, 30 minutes, uh, I think. I should all right with you. Okay. Thank you, Holman. Yeah, I was... I was... You know, five laps from the end is going to be happy with third. I thought you guys were just totally out of reach. And then I realized you three stopped, um, much to some surprise. And you were hauling ass, dude. Your fastest lap was like over half a second faster than mine. So I thought it was all done, wrapped up, and I was just kind of cruising. Um, and then I'm coming down the pit, the pit trick on the last lap, and I'm like, where's Windfire? Why hasn't he exited the pits yet? Oh my god, he's exiting now? That was quite a surprise. Uh, now we're putting on softs. Alright, so now we're done with our pit stops at this point. We're not even halfway through the race. Going, going long on softs I think was the wise decision. Yes, they did. of them and their race car up on the wall. Sir, only German beer. Maybe a Malbec. And lots of beef cooked on hot stones. That'll be my restaurant. With gummy bears for dinner. Or uh, dessert. We'll have like a, a special gummy worm chocolate martini. That's it. What's up, dude? Tier and nine, hey guys, tier and nine, hey guys, wow. tier and nine, hey guys. Holy cow, nine, welcome Twitch, everybody. Hot damn. Cyrus, you knew this already, but I love you. <laughs> the one and only Horn Pub. WTF is a ring. I'm such a little bitch. Yo yo yo. Is this the Horn Pub? Oh, that's so funny. <laughs> That's awesome. 
Yo, everybody. Berkey. It's uh, 8811. I did uh, medium, I think, 5, hard 1, and then sauce for 12. I was able to make the last 12. One goal is perfect. <laughs> Thanks, dude. Thank you, Erky. Yeah, putting it sideways on the hood, that was also a wise idea. It's very sharp. I really like what's put together. White and blue feels good to uh -huh. me too. I, I kind of like that combo. You're not going to make socks last one to LOL. <laughs> well, you can try. But I think, yeah, the Ferrari, I think, is very, very easy on the tires. So that, that was my big advantage this race. Not really any outright speed, but just, uh, you know, a stable car that didn't act up as the tires got worn. Thank you, Pelican. I'm going to try and do this more regularly. And certainly with, uh, you know, regionals and finals coming up, um, I'm going to be uh, doing a lot of Gran Turismo streaming. Ah, oh, that's awesome. Gosh, for everyone uh, who's just joined, thank you very much. Um, just had a very exciting race. Uh, let's uh, skip ahead a little bit, because I think I'm just chasing down Prana. Yep, here we go. We got Cooper, who came out the, of the pits in front of me. I think he's on his hard tire right now? No, he's on the medium. I'm, I'm just uh, three, four laps into my sauce. Just a bit further back. Just a tiny little tap. And I backed off to make sure I didn't punt him. I got a little run, surprisingly, and then I, uh, he uh, gave me a nice little lift. I think he wanted to blend to save time. Smart. I do that too. I did that at the top 16 and Jimmer's like, why is Tristan doing that? Well, do you not see four other cars get pushed off into the Shadow Realm this race, Jimmy? That's why I, I blend it. It's, it's a wise decision, you know, especially because um, I've got a tire advantage. That means that uh, he can use my draft to catch up and then I gap him a little bit in the corners and if he's fast enough, the draft will uh, exaggerate his pace. decision. <laughs> Takes one to no one. Yeah, our friend, it does feel good. I am the wise decision. Who roasted? it? <laughs> Kim Sognit, this I heard, that's true. MOG motorway, MOG spiral shell. So funny. Oh, road plan. Of course. Alright, let's uh, just get forward a bit until we are... Alright, now we're looking at Prana. Uh, he was keeping up with me in the S's, so I want to see uh, his perspective here. He is on Sox as well. We have about equal wear. He's got a little bit more in the rear left than I do. Looks like we had somewhat similar strategies, I think. Yeah, he blended as well. Oh, and then Chris went off. And then Chris uh, Chris pulled off uh, to the right, and I just barely missed him. Watch how close this is to a collision. I did not expect him to pull off to the right right here. Whoa! Yeah, buddy. <laughs> Yeah, Prana was nice. 
Um, yeah, Prana, Prana didn't make any contact and, and didn't lunge, but I, I think I was maybe just a little uh, far enough ahead that he didn't think of it. Um, I was trying really hard to do well in the Degners here because uh, a good Degner 2 exit um, means that you're safe from dive bombs. You can see I just did it pretty well, pulled away from him, and assume my normal breaking point and line, tuck it in there at the apex. No longer distracted by his presence, and just kind of get on with it. I heard Prana was not so nice to Cyrus. Sad to hear that. Um, Cyrus, what's your version of events? He was totally fine today. Oh, well, that's good. I just hold Gorgeous only out. She wasn't not so nice to him. <laughs> He delivered to me multiple times the first time we raced. So I think I never forgot you. Yeah, so Holman's in the pits now. Be right back. Alright, so Holman still has to do his third stop. He's doing the one lap on mediums and then he does one lap on hards. I think I catch it at all. You can kind of see me back there, but yeah. Alright, so here's the surprising one. I can't believe that this worked out the way it did. Alright, here it comes. There I am in his mirror. Full head of steam. Whoa! Yeah, buddy! Oh, epic. Oh, that was so cool looking. Right now, he keeps up, too. He's got hearts. My sauce are pretty worn, look at that. I'd say that's a good 30-40% worn, and that's like, they're at like, what, I don't know. I think they, they hit a cliff at about one-third worn. was a high-pressure situation. Windfire's great at chasing people. Doesn't really put a foot wrong when he's got direct motivation. You know, it's uh, a carrot works for him. Just gonna hit my marks. Almost, almost put it into the dirt there. The car's getting Did real loose on the brake. Uh, no, sir. I started on the mediums. I did mediums for five laps, hit it. One lap on hards and then 12 laps on socks. One set of socks. And should be frog the two guys in front of me. Barely. Alright, good exit from the spoon. Super critical. That's it. Right on the limit, look at that. This 130R was epic right there. Brake a little conservatively, now the car is real loose. I'm kind of fighting it from the last chicane, but hold on to it. It's so close. This was like such a freaking close finish. There we go. Alright. Let's get a let's get a picture of this. So there's the finish. Just barely ahead of him. Man. That's not going to work. I think, I think that will be pretty good. Down a little bit so the sleeve isn't blocking. Yeah. Yeah. Sleeve through the full line. 
yeah, the full checkered, uh, just a little bit to the right there. I tilt up slightly. I know, I know. This is just positioning the starting point. I like how that guy's wrist is bent at just a ridiculous angle. It almost looks like he has two wrists. He's like a double jointed flagman. Before I apply filters, let's just see how this looks. Oh boy, what a freaking race. Okay, I think I can do, yeah, let's just try 60th. See what kind of blur we get. That's okay, I think 125 will be our magic. All right, so now we got to get the filter, we got to get some vignette. Uh, yeah, why don't we try this one? Nope. Too much contrast. Uh, let's see, how about this guy? I might... Uh, right about there, and let's reduce the glare. Don't need quite so much. Let's try that out. What is this? Some kind of static movie? <laughs> yes. You know A moving picture? Preposterous. That's fine. All right, we'll just share this one and then we'll wrap this up. Worst FPS ever. <laughs> I'll get on the phone with Sony Pronto. All right. Just past two hours. Probably a good time to wrap it up. Uh, everybody who's, who's joined and who's watched and commented, thank you guys very, very get much. On the horn with corporate. Yeah, exactly. Uh, I next intend to stream um, either tomorrow or Friday, as well as uh, I think probably Saturday, do more FIA races. Uh, and next week it's going to be uh, at minimum Tuesday, Thursday, if not more than that, maybe even um, every day. Uh, because we expect to get the driver briefing email for the uh, nation's regional uh, in the next cu couple of days. And then i got to put nose to the and grindstone, no uh, get as, as fast as I can, dialed in as I can. Uh, so I put in a maximum effort. So uh, catch me on the flip side. I, I'm always going to be streaming in the afternoon, evening. Um, and if I get some viewers, maybe I can raid Cy back uh, and make up for this, um, you know, to whom I owe a great uh, debt of thanks. So again, thank you everyone for watching. Um, thanks for tuning in to uh, Road Beef TV. Ooh, and fine, I but will yet look forward to catching to you affiliate. on the flip side. I got to raid you one of these days. <laughs> Likewise, dude. Thank you, Moving Chicane. Yeah, I mean, I'm just starting out, so I don't know how much I can raid with, but uh, we'll get there. And um, you owe me nothing beautiful. Have I've, a great one. I've already received. Oh, thanks, dude. I've already received, you know, so much help, and I want to give the help back. Uh, you know, if we support each other, this will certainly be, um, you know, a successful endeavor for all of us. Anyway, thanks again, guys, and uh, wish everyone a pleasant evening or morning wherever now you are, kiss. and we'll see you next time. Smooch.